Hi, my name is Nargis. In the previous video, we learned how to embed an OpenStreetMap in our web page. And in this video, we are going to customize the marker and bind a simple pop-up to that marker. Here are the scripts which I had used for creating the map. And at this line, I create a marker. Here, I create a new variable and name it icon options. And set variable for title attribute. We use title attribute uh, to show a text when the user hover on the marker. For example, company name. And set value for draggable attribute. We can set it true or false to determine whether the marker is draggable or not. Here, I set it to true. And the next step is adding these options to our marker. So here after the location, I add icon options. And now if I hover on a marker, you can see the text and I can drag it. But we still see the default marker icon. In order to change it, I define a new variable and name it custom icon. and set value for icon URL. The value should be the URL for uh, the icon image. It can be relative or absolute. Here I have an icon in my images folder. So the path would be images marker icon.png. And I also want to set size for my icon using icon size. It's an array. 4040 40. and then for creating an icon instance I use L dot icon and pass this variable and store it in a new variable and finally we should add this variable to icon attribute let's see the result okay our new icon is here but we can use an div element instead of an image for this purpose i just copy this line comment out this line and we only should uh, change this to div icon and if i refer refresh the page uh, you can see a little white square if i inspect that you can see it's just the div with some classes and some size it has a default class name leaflet div icon uh, so you can design it uh, as you like but I prefer to use an image instead of div for this tutorial. But you have to decide which method is better for you. Alright, let's turn into binding pop-up. The first and the easiest way to binding pop-up is using bind pop-up method. Marker dot bind pop-up we can put our content here and next open pop-up we use open pop-up to open the bound pop-up our pop-up is here and we can close it or open it again but there is a more complicated way to creating pop-up uh, actually a standalone pop-up let's see how to do that i define another variable and name it pop-up l dot pop-up we use pop-up to instantiate a pop-up object and next we should set the geographical points uh, set uh, i use the same latitude and longitude but they shouldn't be the same. Next, I use set content to put our content. I use HTML to show you that we can also use HTML. Uh, 
and then open on and pass the map and map object. Uh, the open on adds the pop up to the map and closes the previous one. Let's if it's work. Okay, uh, our new pop up and we are done. Thanks for watching. I hope you have found this video useful.